The views and opinions expressed in this podcast do not necessarily reflect those of any major corporation whatsoever. What we like to do here on the podcast is we like to start out the show with a with a previously on, just to let you know what we're doing, what 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 plot lines are happening, what happened in the last episode, in the last couple of episodes. So, without any further ado, as a public service, really, because we're sort of heroes yes as a public service to you the listener previously on the pope on phil it has been five long and deadly years since the galactic federation began its long and bloody war with the dreaded galaxians (laughs) carpathian captain lewis believes he can end the war with an ancient weapon that legends say is hidden on the planet Bunnytopia. Mm-hmm. So Captain Lewis gets a search party together. Meanwhile, Mzar and Kaylina light jump to the planet Shizar to meet with the Genilums to negotiate <laughs> trade routes for Federation ships. But their ship is attacked by the dreaded Galaxians, and yet they appear to be saved from the explosion by a mysterious being known only as Stevia. <laughs> Will Captain Lewis be able to end the bloody war with the Galaxians? Find out tonight on the Pope on Film. Better than Star Wars, baby. Thank you. Uh, that is what I assume Babylon 5 is about. Uh, pretty much. Pretty yeah. much. Don't really know, but that's my assumption, and I think it, it's a pretty good assumption. It, it had more than one captain, so that's where a lot of people slip up, you know. But yeah. it's it's understandable because you only had that first captain for the first season, although his character had recurring roles and he was very pivotal to the overall plot line. Um, Babylon Five was was one of the first series that was scripted out for the full five seasons. Very nice. So it was the Very first. Nice. I appreciate that. It carried off a nice mythos. Yeah. Throughout so the I've... series. But yeah. then that captain was replaced uh, by Bruce Boxleitner. I love just oh. saying that man's name. Bruce. Oh, yeah. That's Boxleitner. Great <laughs> Bruce Boxleitner. Boxleitner, yes. Bruce <laughs> Boxleitner.